Hi, this is Mabel's Tables, and I am doing a collab with Penny of at Penny's Place and Gigi at Gigi's Creations. And they asked us to make a vignette celebrating St. Patrick's Day. This is my vignette for St. Patrick's Day. And while you are looking at my vignette, I would like to share with you some history about St. Patrick. Actually, St. Patrick was not Irish. He was a Briton that was born to wealthy and elite parents and was stolen at the age of 16 and made a slave. And uh, the people that enslaved him were from Ireland because they took over the, his mom and dad's uh, wealth and uh, took him to Ireland as a slave. Uh, while he was there, he got a notation from God to leave after he had been there working with them for a while. He got a chance to get away. And when he got away, he went back to his country of Britain. And as he was there, the Lord spoke to him again and sent him back to Ireland. And when he went back to Ireland, he uh, coached the people on Christianity. So this is how um saint patrick became known and as of this day we have not he has not really been canonized that means been recognized as a saint but the people in ireland look upon him as saint patrick because he brought to them jesus he brought to them christianity and the word of god so we have a lot to think about we don't know how god's going to use people and why he used people. But we must understand that it's in God's time and in God's way that St. Patrick answered the call of God to go on in and to do what he had to do to bring the people to Christ. And it has nothing to do with the luck of the Irish. There's no luck in getting to know Christ. This is Mabel's Table saying thank you so very much for looking at my vignette. And I pray that everything be okay in your life and that when God calls you, that you make the call just like St. Patrick did. He went on and did what God asked him to do. And in my vignette, I have two hats depicting uh, the land of Ireland. And you know I have green because green is supposed to be the color of everything in Ireland is lush and green. So I would like to say thank you to St. Patrick, to his spirit, for going and answering the call of God. This is Mabel's Table saying, don't forget to pray for someone else besides yourself. And always know that God is in large and in charge and that this is his world from Ireland to the Americans. This is God's world. And whatever he will, it will be done. Whatever he wish, it shall be done. Mabel's Table saying, adieu.